Every country is different, and every country's laws are different. Sometimes these laws border on the seriously ridiculous, and other times they point to important cultural values that might be different than your own. We've compiled a list of weird laws around the world you may not believe exist. But when you're traveling, you certainly don't want to wind up behind bars. 1. It's illegal to chew gum in Singapore. Sometimes we all suffer when fools break the rules. After vandals used chewing gum to mess with the mass rapid transit system and the Housing and Development Board spent $150,000 a year to clean gum leader, Singapore banned all gum substances in 1992. Anyone importing, selling or making gum in Singapore can get fined in or jail time, with the exception of nicotine and dental gums offering therapeutic value. Don't get caught blowing bubbles in the streets. 2. Canadian radio stations must play Canadian artists. The Canadians are a patriotic bunch. So much so that all Canadian radio stations are required, by law, to play Canadian artists on the airwaves at least 35% of the time especially during the hours of 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. Monday through Friday. This means that in an hour of radio during the work week, you'll hear more than 20 minutes of artists like Nickelback, Alanis Morissette, Celine Dion, Michael Bublé and Justin Bieber, all of whom are proud Canucks. 3. It's illegal to run out of gas on the German Autobahn. Notorious for having dynamic speed limits that give drivers a chance to travel more than 100 miles per hour, car enthusiasts and speed demons love trips along the German Autobahn. But, if you run out of gas, you could face a big fine. And don't even think of walking to a gas station. You'll get another fine for that. Why? Germans believe you have the power to keep your car properly gassed up, so if you run out of gas, it's your own fault. Walking along the highway is unsafe, as is having your vehicle stalled on or on the side of the road. Keep your eyes on your gas gauge and fill her up when you get low. 4. It's illegal to feed pigeons in Venice, Italy. With thousands of pigeons descending upon St. Mark's Square in Venice, lured by the the tourists readily handing out food in exchange for Instagram-worthy photos, Venice lawmakers officially made it illegal to feed the pesky fowl in 2008. It is said the cleanup from the birds cost each citizen 275 per year, so now, the tables are turned. If you're caught feeding the pigeons, you could face fines of up to 700. Better to get the picture-perfect shot of Venice's beautiful bridges instead. 5. It's illegal to wear high heels to the Acropolis. When packing for a trip to Greece, make sure you have the right shoes. The country banned high heels at the Acropolis in 2009, so no stilettos at the Parthenon. Not sure why anyone would want to make a trek around the ruins and dirt in heels. Surely it's tough to walk and will damage the shoes, but the Greeks put this ban in place to protect its ruins from damage caused by the sharp shoes. The ruins are nearly 2,500 years old, so be respectful and wear some soft-soled shoes when you visit. 6. Men must wear speedos on French beaches. Did you think the French just really liked their speedos? Actually, 
It's French law that men do not wear loose-fitting swim trunks on beaches, swimming pools and other public places where a swimsuit is required attire. The law wasn't for safety, but rather that men wouldn't dare walk around town in a speedo, so if he wears a speedo in the water, it surely would be cleaner than something he may have been wearing all day long. This need to avoid clothing that could have been worn throughout the day also extends to t-shirts. You'll need to lose those as fast as your surfer shorts. 7. No selfies with Buddha in Sri Lanka When you take a selfie with Buddha, you are turning your back on him. Tisk, tisk. This sign of disrespect is punishable by imprisonment in Sri Lanka. It is also considered disrespectful to point your finger at Buddha, and sometimes there are bans on taking photos with the statues. Although not illegal to have tattoos of Buddha, a British woman was jailed for three days in 2014 for inappropriate tattoos of the man 70% of Sri Lankans feel is a prophet and avatar of the god Vishnu. Be polite and cover tattoos, respect no photograph, signs, and don't turn your back on him. 8. It's illegal to wear a mask in public in Denmark. Not only masks, the Danish government wants to stop anyone from covering their faces in any way in public spaces. This includes masks, helmets, scarves, hats, fake beards and even burkas. The controversial ban went into effect in August 2018. Officials claim the ban helps to properly identify people during crowded events, should anything negative happen and someone need to be identified. 9. Don't wear your Winnie the Pooh t-shirt in Poland. The cuddly little bear all stuffed with fluff also, gasp, does not wear pants. Because of this, Poland issued a ban on Winnie the Pooh around playgrounds and schools, finding the A.A. Milne character a bit too risque for the likes of impressionable children. Best to leave your bear attire at home if visiting this Eastern European country, just to be safe. 10. It's illegal to swear in the UAE. In the Muslim United Arab Emirates, Swearing could get you fined, jailed or deported. Under Article 373 of the UAE Penal Code, swearing disgraces the honor or the modesty of a person. This isn't just for saying the inappropriate words aloud. It includes indecent physical gestures and extends to your text messages and social media, as well. Not even indecent emojis are allowed. Earlier this year, the British Express reported a man sent an angry message to a car dealer who seemingly did him wrong. He was threatened with three weeks in jail for his choice of words. If you have a potty mouth, be sure it's in check before you visit.